Welcome back, 514 right now. Take it to Shelton where police say thieves are targeting the homes of Asian American business owners. Cash, jewelry, purses all stolen in July from a home in the city's Huntington section. Yeah, a lot of concern in that community. News 8's Natasha Lubchenko live with the very latest on the police investigation. Natasha. Keith Laura, while police tell us this was no random act, they believe that surveillance was done by the burglar before the break-in. And we have learned that the home that was broken into was that of a local business owner. Shelton police do tell us that this is an unfortunate trend around the country. These crimes targeting Asian American business owners who have largely cash run businesses. And that is why that these types of crimes, they are being the focus right now of the state's Fusion Center. The center monitors these trends and patterns and shares that information with local, state, federal, and private partners. So this is something they are working on, trying to put a stop to. Now back to that Shelton investigation, the suspect has been identified as 42-year-old Jun Kang Zhang. He was caught in Great Barrington, Massachusetts. The good news here, those stolen items were recovered. It's like, you know, criminals are using technology, so are police, and working together and sharing that information. We're able to do it much faster with our law enforcement partners, not only in state, but out of state. And those good working relationships really help, you know, solve these cases in a timely manner. And we also spoke with the head of the state's Fusion Center. He has some tips for community members on how to spot uh, these criminals before they actually uh, burglarize homes. So we will have those tips for you coming up in our next half hour. For now, live in Chicago, back to you guys.